See that ruin up there? Bleak Falls Barrow. I never understood how my sister could stand living in the shadow of that place. I guess you get used to it. Hey guys, so welcome back to our Skyrim adventure series. And today we're going to continue where we left off. I pretty much um, just escaped Helgen with this guy Rayloff. And we will continue our journey towards Riverwood, which is a town not far from here. And uh, yeah, let's go Rayloff, come on. Come on. Have anything else to say? I feel better once we're undercover in Riverwood. Hmm. Ulfric's capital is Windhelm, northeast of here. You'll want to talk to Galmar Stonefist, Ulfric's right-hand man. He handles the new recruits. I'll be sure to put in a good word if I get to Windhelm ahead of you. All right, deal. Thanks, Rail. Better keep moving. Come on, let's don't go. Don't want to run into any Imperials who know what happened at Helgen. Mm, you know, me, me, and you think alike. So let's go. Now. I love Skyrim's ambience. It's just a game that I could actually live in. <laughs> so, yeah. These are the Guardian Stones. Three of the 13 ancient standing stones that dot Skyrim's landscape. Go ahead. See for yourself. Alright, so the Thief Stone, the Mage Stone, and the Warrior Stone. Now, we are going to go with the Mage Stone because I. In this let's play or gameplay or playthrough or in this adventure I am going to play as a mage character and yeah this will this this stone allows me to learn all magic skills 20% faster which is, which is a really good thing so yeah mage, eh? well, to each his own. it's not for me to judge nice okay there, let's go Onwards to Riverwood. There's some flowers here and then along the way. I'm, I'm gonna mind it. Might as well just pick them up, right? Remember, this isn't Stormcloak territory. If we're ahead of the news from Helgen, we should be fine. As long as we don't do anything stupid. If we run into any Imperials. Just let me do the talk, alright? Okay, we'll do. Help! I'm going to put you down! Wow, Rayloff. <laughs> you did everything ahead of me. You decided to come with me. We're almost to Riverwood. Oh, there it is. I already see it. That was some weird noise. <laughs> Girder. Brother, Mara's mercy, it's good to see you. But is it safe for you to be here? Girder. We heard that Ulfric had been captured. Girder, I'm fine. At least now I am. Are you hurt? What's happened? And who is this? One of your comrades? Not a comrade yet, but a friend. I owe him my life, in fact. Is there somewhere we can talk? There's no telling when the news from Helgen will reach the Imperials. Helgen? Has something happened? You're right. Follow me. Hod, come here a minute. I need your help with something. 
What is it, woman? Spend drunk on the job again? Todd, just come here. Raylo, what are you doing here? Ha, I'll be right down. Uncle Raylo, can I see your axe? How many Imperials have you killed? Do you really know Ulfric Stormcloak? Hush, Frodnar. This is no time for your games. Go and watch the South Road. Come find us if you see any Imperial soldiers coming. Aw, Mama. I want to stay and talk with Uncle Rayla. Look at you. Almost a grown man. Won't be long before you'll be joining the fight yourself. That's right. Don't worry, Uncle Rayla. I won't let those soldiers sneak up on you. Now, Rayla, what's going on? You two look pretty well done in. <sighs> I can't remember when I last slept. Hmm, where to start? Well, the news you heard about Alfred was true. The Imperials ambushed us outside Darkwater Crossing. Like they knew exactly where we'd be. That was... Uh, two days ago now. We stopped in Helgen this morning. And I thought it was all over. Had us lined up to the headsman's block and ready to start chopping. The cowards! They wouldn't dare give Ulfric a fair trial. Treason for fighting for your own people. All of Skyrim would have seen the truth then. But then, out of nowhere, a dragon attacked. You don't mean a real live... I can hardly believe it myself. And I was there. As strange as it sounds, we'd be dead if not for that dragon. In the confusion, we managed to slip away. Are we really the first to make it to Riverwood? Nobody else has come up the south road today, as far as I know. Good. Maybe we can lay up for a while. I hate to put your family in danger, Gerda, but... Nonsense. You and your friend are welcome to stay here as long as you need to. Let me worry about the Imperials. Any friend of Raylov's is a friend of mine. Here's the key to the house. Stay as long as you like. If there is anything else you need, just let me know. Well, thank you. Uh, let's see if there is anything I could need. Uh, you know, let's take one need. Just for fun. Uh, you know what? I'm not going to say no to a free lockpick. And uh, some free, some free minor potions of healing that would also come in handy. And I saw garnet. Like, yeah, why not? Get and a piece of bread. Just, just, just you know, for the road. There is something you could do for me, for all of us here. The Jarl needs to know if there's a dragon on the loose. Riverwood is defenseless. We need to get word to Jarl Balgruf in Whiterun to send whatever troops he can. If you'll do that for me, I'll be in your debt. Thanks, I'll do that. I knew we could count on you. I ought to get back to work before I missed, but did anyone else escape? Did Ulfric? Don't worry. I'm sure he made it out. It will take more than a dragon to stop Ulfric's storm from. I'll let them into the house and, you know, show them where everything is. Hmm. Help them drink up our mead, you mean? Good luck, brother. I'll see you later. Don't worry about me. I know how to lay low. I'm glad to help any way I can. Okay. I told you my sister would help us out. Yeah, you're right. I hope to see you in Windhelm. Good luck. How do I get from White Run from here? Just I mean, to White. Can't miss it. It's the capital of White Run Hold. Jarl Balgruf still hasn't declared for one side or the other. So at least you won't run into any Imperials along the way. Alright, cool. Well, uh, see you around, Raylof. I'm going to rest up here a while before heading to Windhelm. Be careful. You too, man. Okay, let's follow the... Uh, what was it? What was this, this guy's name? Uh, Hod. Yeah, Hod. Let's follow this guy to the house, because he said he was going to show me to his house, right? 
I will stay a day in Riverwood, uh, yeah, Riverwood, until I, before I proceed my journey to White Run, just so I can explore around a little bit and see who's here, you know, meet the people, kind of, you know, get uh, accustomed to this village and, you know, somehow like meet some new people and uh, see if there's anything good in Riverwood before I head on. Yeah, you can actually. So you saw a dragon, did you? Tell me, what was it like? As big as a house? Who? It was actually bigger. Mm -hmm. Um, much bigger than that. As big as the inn. Well, I'll be. That'd be a sight to see. Uh, not that I actually want to see one. Understand? <laughs> I hope that dragon stays far away from here. Yeah, it would not be good if it it landed like right here on your house. So here for work, get um, an axe and bring me all the wood you can chop. What do you think about the war? I've got enough to worry about taking care of my family. I don't concern myself with such matters. Yeah, that's actually pretty smart. Until so next time. Ah, <sighs> it's nice to have like a warm place to stay after a. Uh, after what went down on in he in Helgen, can I? Yeah, no, I, I'm not. I'm not gonna take from them. I'll find my own goal along the way. Uh, although this stuff here, no, did I? I didn't want to do that. No one saw anything. Um, it is tempting to like take all this stuff, but uh. I'm not gonna do it because child's dull. This is kind of creepy though. But yeah, I'm not gonna do it. I'm obviously not gonna steal from from the people who actually took me in. So even if it's not actually stealing, I, don't know, I won't do it. I hope to see you in Windhelm. Good luck. Yeah. Good I'm luck to you too, Rattle. Up here a while before heading to okay, so now we're in Riverwood, and I think. May the gods watch over your battles, friend. Did you just stop eating just to tell me that? How nice of you. <laughs> uh, so yeah, I'm gonna... I'm gonna... Spend the rest of the day in Riverwood. Just like going around a little bit. Seeing what's... To s what's there to see. And I wanna... I wanna... I wanna actually talk to Gerda if I find her again. Just to see if there's... Anything important she says. Gerda. Where are you, Gerda? Uh, is, her name is kinda... 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 Yeah. Kind of hard to pronounce. Okay, let's see. Where did she go? I, 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 she's probably around the mill somewhere. No? She's already in use. Okay. Let's cut this in half. Gonna do some work around here, might as well, because... You know, the people here are so nice to take me in. I might as well just help them out a little bit, right? Oh, this ought to be satisfying. If any of you guys ever, um... I ever cut wood before it's pretty satisfying especially with an axe if you just like hit it perfectly and it like flies in half that's really like satisfying where did Gerda go did she leave uh, Riverwood hey grandma no. did you hear the Riverwood trader was robbed poor Lucan must be torn to pieces over it really it was robbed By Shore. what do you want oh Nah, I'm almost not gonna break into the house. The Riverwood Trader. This was a store that was robbed. Well, one of us has to do something. I said no. No adventures, no theatrics, no thief chasing. Well, what are you going to do then, huh? Let's hear it. We are done talking about this. 
Oh, <clears throat> a customer. <laughs> Sorry you had to hear that. Yeah, well, I don't know what you overheard, but the Riverwood Trader is still open. Feel free to shop. The Riverwood Trader is everything you need in a general store. Mm, did something happen? Uh, yeah, we, we did have a bit of a, a break-in. but we, we still have plenty to sell. Robbers were only after one thing. An ornament. Solid gold in the shape of a dragon's claw. I could help you get that claw back. You could? I've got some coin coming in from my last shipment. It's yours if you bring my claw back. Now, if you're going to get those... Show those thieves not to steal from Lucan Valerius. What did he say? Till next time. So this is your plan, Lucan? Yes. So now you don't have to go, do you? Oh, really? Well, I think your new helper here needs a guide. Well, no, I... By the eight, fine. But only to the edge of town. Yeah, but first, hold on. The sooner on. you find the claw, the sooner our lives can get back to normal. I think I have a few old spell books laying about. If you want more, you'll have to go to the College of Winterhold. Okay, let's see. Items above the divider line belong to the vendor. Items below belong to you. Okay, good. Let's see if he has anything uh, useful here. Let's see the books. Ooh. He's actually got a lot of spells. Hum. But, uh, I might buy like some of them later. But for now, I think just let's buy Magicka Potions. Wait, how much gold do I have? I have zero gold. Oh god, I didn't even notice that. Apparel. Can I sell? I'm actually going to sell something. Let's see. Shield. Uh, where is the... Ooh, Stormcloak. Let's see. Value. It's only eight. Hmm. I'm actually gonna... Oh, I can sell the Garnet that I got uh, recently. Okay. You know what? That's good for now. Thanks, man. Now let's follow the... The... What's-her-face... Uh, you have to go through town and across Camellia. the bridge to get to Bleak Falls Barrow. You can see it from here, though. The mountain just over the buildings. All right, lead the way. But hold on. This way. This way. Okay, she won't talk to me. Let's go. So after she shows me the way, I'm just gonna like go back to the Riverwood and kind of like what? What? Are you not coming? What? Did I do something wrong? <laughs> ah well. I think she was about to bring me this way. Are you just This way. Are you possessed? What the hell just happened? Wait, let's wait for one hour. Let's see if she, that she changes. Ah, oh, she will change now. Okay. Or won't she change? Come on. Really? Yeah, okay. God, that was weird. Can you stop stopping, Camilla? Like... Are you possessed? You know what? I'm gonna just follow her really slowly. So she doesn't freak out. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> I wonder why they only stole Lucan's golden claw. I mean, we have plenty of things in the shop that are worth just as much coin. Lucan found the claw about a year after he opened the store. He never quite explained where he got it. He's a tricky one. Hmm. I believe that. so peaceful out here right now. This is the bridge out of town. 
The path up the mountain to the northwest leads to Bleak Falls Barrow. I guess I should get back to my brother. He'll throw a fit if I take too long. <laughs> Such a child. Yeah, no problem. You go ahead. You know, I'll also go back to Riverwood. Thank you for showing me the way. I might, um... Where's the Bleak Falls Barrow? I think it's... I think that's up there, right? Yeah. Um... This girl is kind of creepy, though. Not gonna lie. Hey, chicken, what's up? Um, so... Oh, look, a dog. So, I I'm... Not gonna head out there right now. Because I'm still at Riverwood. I still haven't see, um, seen everything there is to see. Hey, what's up, Stump? Good boy. Uh, so, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna explore some more like let's but it's night right now so I don't think many people are gonna be out but let's just like see if there's anything cool around the town where does this go I think this goes like out of the town right there's something up there I might explore it later but for now let's stay in the town cuz I don't really have anything to defend me that much Thistle or Thistle. What is Fandal's house? I'm not gonna go breaking in people's houses right now. <laughs> I'm just gonna go look around a little bit. This is the blacksmith. Oh, sorry. It is so peaceful out here. Like. Honestly, I <laughs> I could move into this game, just live in here forever. No, I can't go under the bridge. It would be really cool if there. Oh, I could go under the bridge, you know, like a Khajiit cat, like a real cat. Yeah. Okay. Let's throw one more log on there, just for fun. Just to do some extra work for them. Honestly, man, how can you move that giant uh, trunk or log or whatever? There you go. No problem, Gerder. Gerder. Her name is weird. Okay, there's no people out here right now, so I'm gonna go into the house. Is th This is our house, right? I think. No, this is Fennel's house. Oh, yeah, I missed one block. Or one. Uh, hey there. Chicken's nest. There's one egg. I might cook that later. I wonder if I can cook that. Uh, yeah, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go into the Hodden Gerder's house. Oh my, Gerder might be in here. And, um, I'm gonna spend the night here, and in the morning, I will explore the Riverwood a little bit more. I'll talk to the people that I haven't talked to yet. Uh, this, I think this is an inn. I'm not... Yeah, I, th I think this is an inn. Right here. The Sleeping Giant Inn, yep. So I'll visit that in the morning, and yeah, but let's, I'm gonna go to bed, because I am beat. It's been a long day, I guess, with Helgen and stuff, so let's go. I'm gonna sleep here. Ah, uh, no thanks, Raylof. Oh, there she is. Make yourself at home. Uh, I haven't talked to you yet, so I'll, I'll just talk to you real quick um is there someone i can buy fresh supplies and by supplies i suppose you mean weapons and armor alvar can help you out he's our blacksmith well, i'll make sure to visit him in the morning uh what do you think about the war the empire may have been good for skyrim once upon a time but those days are long past banning the worship of talos was the last straw thalmor everywhere 
dragging people off for honoring our own gods. I'm glad Raylof is helping drive them out of here. If I was a bit younger, I might have joined the fight myself. Yeah, I agree. Uh, what can you tell me about Riverwood? It's my mill. Some folks think it's my town too, but it ain't. The Jarl in Whiterun owns the land and the town. I just pay the taxes. What can you tell me about the Jarl? Jarl Balgruf? I don't mean to be disrespectful as he's ruled Whiterun hold well for years, but he seems in over his head now. He's been trying to stay out of the war, but it can't last. He's going to have to pick a side. I'm afraid he's going to make the wrong choice. Good night, Hod. And uh, why? Is he loyal to the Emperor? I wouldn't say that. But he and Ulfric have been at odds for years, and I'm afraid Balgruf will end up siding with the Empire because of it. But it's hard to believe that even Balgruf would choose Elisif over Ulfric. Who's Elisif? I suppose she's Jarl Elisif now. She married High King Turig just before Ulfric killed him. The Empire supports her claim to be High Queen. I don't really have anything against her. Not her fault that her husband Turig was bought and paid for by the Empire. But she's nothing but a puppet for the Empire now, with her husband Turig dead. Ulfric will make sure she never takes the throne as High Queen. Ulfric killed the High King, so there's no High King now. Uh, Ulfric killed the High King? Some say murdered, but it was a lawful challenge in the old way. Ulfric called him out as a traitor to Skyrim and killed him in single combat. If Tori couldn't defend his throne, he had no business being High King. I, I kind of agree with that. So there's no High King now? No, not until the Moot meets to choose another. And it won't meet until one side or the other wins the war. Don't worry though. Ulfric is our rightful High King. He'll drive out the Empire and Skyrim will have peace at last. Okay. Uh, I wish you the best of luck with that. Um, how do I get f uh, to Y Run from here? I already asked that. Uh, asked uh, Rail of that, I think. So. Cross the river and then head north. You'll see White Run on its hill as you pass the falls. Nice. Uh, do you have any supplies I could take? Like I said, I'm glad to help in any way I can. Help yourself to whatever you need within reason. <laughs> within reason, I already took a lot of them, a lot of uh, things from you, so I'm not gonna do it. Um, thank you for now, girl. Gerder. Ger um, hold on. I do have some. I do have mead. Where's food? Food. I do have black briar mead. Uh, th this is the mead that I took from. From a girder before, right? I'm gonna take it, just just for fun, and I'm gonna save bread for later. But uh, yeah. Hold on. Is there anything? Oh yeah, I already looked into this chest. Well, this is uh, where I'm gonna call it a a day. Oh no, 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 no. Ah. Uh, Hod, I think you got a problem here, buddy. Like, I think. At wake least up. the damn war hasn't gotten here. Your wife is sleeping the in a. I see is dead. Your wife is sleeping in a bunk bed while you're sleeping in a. I guess they had a fight or something, huh, Raylof? But uh, I don't feel comfortable sleeping here alongside her. So, because she she's his uh, wife. So, <laughs> I was just about to call her a day. Uh, but I'm gonna, I guess I'm gonna call her a day here on this chair right here. And I'm gonna sleep here. <laughs> so uh yeah hope you guys uh enjoyed join me next time where we will continue exploring riverwood and um yeah this was it hope you enjoyed and peace out